Sorry, fellas. Well, so long, honey. Sorry we missed that last race, but it was a great day. Just great. Even if I was the only one dressed like this. I did tell you, Tim. We only wear all that for Ascot. Lieutenant Morton. Well, beauty calls. An initiative test. How simply marvelous. It's terribly me. I'm not supposed to have any help, you know. Oh, what fun. Besides, it means promotion. You're always saying how tough it is on a lieutenant pay. Annabelle, you got all those debutante parties. Doesn't Lady France McDonough ring a bell? No. But here's a library. You can look it up in that book that has all the lords and ladies in it. Oh, don't just stand there. Why don't you do something? Why don't you run out? What's up with her? She wants my clothes. Uh? They belong to her husband. I told you, mine got wet. Oh, I'm sure. Did you get a chance to look up the Lady McDonough? Yes. She's a rose. A what? It's the name of a rare rose. Uh, it's a flower. Oh, of course. I know just where you can find one. Hang on, darling. Oh, what fun. I haven't been here since I was taken by a nanny. I remember I bit one of the keepers. You might have to do it again if they give us any trouble. Now, how do you know there's a rose in there? I just do. No! No, no! I say, steady on, madam. Rudolph, it's been years. Oh, my gosh, you're not. I'm terribly sorry. You must think I'm absolutely loose. No, it's all right. <laughs> I do these things all the time. It's my eyes. They're terrible. I should wear my glasses. Oh, don't worry. It was uh, quite pleasant, actually. <laughs> you must have been petrified with embarrassment. <laughs> what can I do to make it up for you? Um, could I give you a lift if you're just leaving? Which way are you going? Well, I was going to London. Oh, well, then I must certainly give you a lift. Now, the gate out is... Oh, but straight ahead. And I had a little red car somewhere. Oh, is this it? Oh, yes. Um, what about your glasses? Oh, I don't need them for driving. <laughs> now, you must come up and have a drink. Well, um, I really have got an awful lot to do, you know. Oh, but I need you to help me carry something. Well, I'll give you a hand, of course. Is this it? Yes. Oh. Listen, you're not going to leave the car like that, are you? Oh, it doesn't mind. Timmy, look what I've got. Good, I got the ducks. You have? Then we'll go and get the rose to the lady. Well, it's not that simple. They're screwed on very tight nowadays. It has to be an old model. We'll find one. Something to eat. I'm starving. Oh, gosh, I couldn't eat. I'm too excited. And the next object is an electric hair. Let's go. Well, what is it? How can anyone get that? The lutein bell. What on earth's the lutein bell? The lutein bell, mounted above the caller's rostrum, 
is famed throughout the world as the symbol of Lloyd's of London. The bell was brought up from the wreck of the frigate Lutine more than a hundred years ago, when they were salvaging her million pound cargo of gold. That was in 1799, and her cargo is insured here at Lloyd's of London, ladies and gentlemen. There's luck for you. It'll be easy without scaffolding up. What about the burglar alarms? That's why I brought this. Oh, what's this? It's a pressure gun filled with rubber cement. One blast into the alarm and then wait 30 seconds. Where'd you get it? I saw it in an absolutely super film. Now hurry up. I got it. Weighs a ton, too. Young man here, an American. I don't know, I've just got here, ain't I? But he can't have forgotten. He's due at the finish line at 10 o'clock. to get the objects handed in. A fiasco, complete disaster. It's your fault. No, it's not, it's not my fault. It's there. There are absolute showers, sir. Look, you can see... What's oh, Morton. It is Morton, isn't Well, it? here they are. Every one of them. Thank you. Even the Lutine Bell. Ah, oh, you won. Right out then, Morton. You're the winner. Congratulations. What's this? Uh, that's my resignation, sir. Could you please see that that gets to my Air Force General? Resignation? What do you think you're doing? You can't resign. I'm sorry, sir. I just did. Well, I have a plane to catch. Amsterdam first, then Nice, I think. If you ever have a war, though, please let me know who wins. 